subscribe, click on the bell, like, comment, share. Do you know the name of this common Malaysian Nyonya dish? The name of this dish is Achar. This is a dish of pickled vegetables normally served during a feast or kanduri. The list of ingredients together with their photographs is displayed. Which of the ingredients used can be grouped as food additives? The turmeric, salt, monosodium glutamate and vinegar are food additives that give the achar its special taste. The turmeric gives the achar its signature color. What are the other functions of food additives besides just improving the flavor and color of food? Let us watch these four video clips on various types of food preparation. You'll then be asked to identify what the food additives are and why they are added. Click on each of the graphics to play the video clip. From these four video clips, we have found out that food additives are natural or synthetic substances added to food to improve the flavor or taste, appearance or color, consistency and to prevent spoilage. Generally, there are four types of food additives based on their uses. They are preservatives and antioxidants, flavorings, stabilizers and thickeners, food dyes, preservatives and antioxidants. Preservatives are used to slow down the decomposition of food and antioxidants, as the name suggests, help to prevent oxidation, especially of fruits, oils and fats. Flavorings. They are the largest group of food additives. They are used to improve the taste of food and also to restore the flavors lost during processing. Stabilizers and thickeners Both the stabilizers and thickeners are used to thicken and maintain the texture and consistency of food such as instant soup and pudding. Food dyes They are also known as food coloring and are used to add or restore color in food and drinks. What are the ingredients needed to make each food or drink item shown? Click on the item to magnify and study the list of ingredients. Identify the food additives and their use in the food and drink items. Key in the additives into the boxes provided according to their uses. Some of the food additives may have more than one use.
Some examples of preservatives are sodium benzoate, sodium nitrite and salt. Sugar and salt are examples of natural flavoring. Monosodium glutamate is an example of a synthetic flavoring. Examples of stabilizers and thickeners are carrageenan, cellulose gum, starch and cornstarch. Examples of food dyes are annatto coloring, carmosine and caramel. Click on each of the graphics to read a short excerpt on various aspects of food additives. You'll then be asked to write a short essay on food additives, do we need them? Click on sample outline when you're finished. Imagine that you are an officer from the Ministry of Health. You have to study the report provided for each of the food additives and make a recommendation. Click on each of the graphics to look at the report and then click to select one of the recommendations. Well done! Malaysian health authorities have recently banned the food additive RED 2G. Well done! MSG is generally safe. Research on this additive has shown that MSG at any concentration is not a significant health hazard. Well done! Malaysian health authorities have allowed the use of benzoic acids and its salts at low concentration levels. Food additives used currently are generally safe because each food additive must undergo a safety evaluation at the concentration allowed before they can be approved by the Ministry of Health. In this lesson, we have learned that food additives are natural or synthetic substances added to food as preservatives and antioxidants help to prevent spoilage of food. Examples are salt, benzoic acid, ascorbic acid and vinegar. Stabilizers and thickeners are used to thicken and maintain the consistency of food. Examples are cornstarch, gelatin, cellulose gum and gua gum. Flavorings. They are used to improve the taste of food and also restore the flavors lost during processing. Examples are monosodium glutamate, sugar, salt and vinegar. Dyes They are used to add or restore color in food and drinks. Examples of food dyes are anato color, carmosine, 
caramel, and turmeric. The use of food additives has given us the following benefits. A wide variety of food is made available through the use of preservatives. Attractive appearance of food through the use of antioxidants stabilizes and food dyes. Ensure food safety and longer shelf life by using acidity regulators. A higher standard of food safety by preventing and minimizing spoilage. Improve on the taste of food by using flavorings. The effects of food additives can generally be divided into three levels. Generally safe. Food additives that are safe to healthy humans at any concentration. An example is monosodium glutamate. Safe below certain concentrations. Food additives that are safe below certain concentrations. Benzoic acid is an example. Generally unsafe. Food additives harmful even at very low concentrations. Red 2G is a food dye that is carcinogenic and is banned in many countries. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon.